Our much loved celebrity Hugh Grant knows exactly how to put a funny spin on pretty much anything, even awkward and embarrassing life moments. So it isn't much of a surprise that his recollection of COVID is exactly like a movie. Earlier this year, Hugh and his wife Anna Eberstein had COVID. Talking virtually on The Late Show with Stephen Colbert on Tuesday 10th November, Grant describes his relief when he found out he has antibodies. He explained that he took the antibodies test last month and it came back positive. We have antibodies. I'm rather proud of them. I got it in around February. I had an antibody test only a month ago and I still have those antibodies so I know that's what it was. Talking about the actual symptoms, Hugh talks of the terrible sweat and the feeling of a man sitting on his chest. It started as just a very strange syndrome where I kept breaking into a terrible sweat. It was like a poncho of sweat, embarrassing really. My eyeballs felt about three sizes too big, this feeling though as some enormous man was sitting on my chest, sort of Harvey Weinstein or someone. When describing the loss of his smell, the 60 year old actor said, I thought, I don't know what this is. Then I was walking down the street one day and thought, I can't smell a damn thing. Then you start to panic. By then, people had been starting to talk about this as a symptom. Just like our much loved character in movies like Two Weeks Notice, Grant then did what anyone would do, sniff flowers and garbage. I started sniffing flowers, nothing. You get more and more desperate, I started sniffing in garbage cans. You want to sniff strangers armpits because you just can't smell anything. Keeping his sense of humour, the Notting Hill actor even went on to joke about trying to smell his wife's perfume. I went home and sprayed my wife's Chanel number no. 5 directly into my face, couldn't smell a thing, I did go blind he added. The Love Actually star married his wife Eberstein, 41, in May 2018 and has five children. In October, he talked about spending time with his children amid the pandemic and even cutting his children's hair. I started by cutting my daughter's Barbie's hair out of sheer boredom and I discovered I was extremely talented, he said on Good Morning America at the time. Then I started cutting my children's hair whether they wanted a haircut or not. I just strapped them to a chair and cut their hair. I would say I'm enchanting, but I don't know what the children would say. Nice to know our favourite actor is safe and has had a productive lockdown and can add hair cutting to his many talents. We can't wait to hear more about him. Thanks for watching, have it all daily. Please like, share and subscribe and check out our website for more.